What's up you guys, Martin here, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a mukbang. A mukbang. A mukbang, bang, bang, a mukbang. I'm doing a mukbang, and I haven't done one of these in a long time, so you guys have to bear with me, okay? God. There's a YouTuber called and named Fluffy, and her channel is Fluffy Hates Fibro. And she's an amazing woman. I have became really close friends with her over the years. And she did a 20 wing challenge. And I think she only got 8 down out of 20. And I think I could beat that, honestly. Uh, I have been losing weight, so this would be my first, like, a lot, like, a lot of food in me. And I'm kind of scared because I might get sick. I hope not. So she chose the wings that she chose. I believe they were Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm not 100% on that, so don't quote me. Uh, but I love Wingstop. Wingstop is my stop. I do not, I'm really picky. I'm really picky, you guys, with wings. And Wingstop is where it's at. Uh, there's not a lot of meat on them, which is what I like. I don't like a lot of fatty meat, a lot of meat on the wings. So Wingstop is where it's at. So today, I got my drink. And no, it is not Shut Up Mona. Uh, Fluffy says that all the time because my mom, Mona, always told her, oh, you shouldn't be drinking soda. So every time Fluffy drinks a soda, she always says it's her shut up Mona. Okay, so it's actually high C. Uh, it's like the juice, but I chose grape juice because they have the machines where you can pick your flavor and that's what I got. So I got grape high C. The wings today, you guys, I got 10 of each. So here are the 10 lemon pepper. I love lemon pepper, you guys. And then I got 10 mild. I, I, I was gonna go with my normal Cajun. Where's my, I was gonna go with my normal Cajun. Um, I love getting the Cajun flavor or the Louisiana rub, but those are really hot and I really wanna try to win this challenge. So I decided to go safe and play with the mild. So there's the mild. Okay. If you guys hear pounding, it's my dog and the cat because they want to come in the room and they're not coming in this room. So I think I'm going to leave my glasses on and the only reason is because it's hard for me to see the screen to see if it's uh, blurry or not. Um, this is a, not a very good angle of me, I must say, um, but this is all I can do. You people that do mukbangs like Fluffy, um, all the people that do it, they have perfect, perfect, they have perfect um, ang camera angles and this is not a good angle of me. So I'm sorry about that, you guys. Also, I... Love blue cheese at Wingstop. I'm not a big blue cheese fan, um, like at a store or anything like that. But at Wingstop, for some reason, it's so freaking good. I can't help myself. So I got some blue cheese dipping. I didn't get ranch because I tend to use the blue cheese more. So I stuck with that. All right, you guys. So let's get into this, shall we? I'm really hungry. I haven't had Wingstop in a while, so I'm excited. I usually get um, fries with the wings, but since this is a challenge, I'm just sticking with the wings. Yum. So, mukbang. I haven't done one in a long time. Oh my god, these already look so freaking good. The lemon pepper is where it's at, you guys. Let me see if I can look at that lemon pepper. Oh. Lemon pepper is so good. Mmm. God damn. This is so good. Mmm. So good. Mmm. You know, if there was a wing stop in my town where I live, it'd be all bad. I'd be eating there all the time. Mm. I just love the wings there. 
It's so good. It's so delicious. Mm -mm -mm. It's really weird for me still to be eating on camera. I feel like some people cry ugly. I cry ugly, but I feel like eat, me eating on video is really weird. So. Oh shit, Taki mushrooms. <laughs> now let's try this mild, you guys. Let's try this mild. I wish I could show you guys like the whole table of me eating, but I'm using TV stands or TV trays and it's not working. So. I just have to do what I can. So here's a mild. Oh my god, here we go again. Mild. And they're not extremely wet, which I'm really um, happy about. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Really good. I love Wingstop. Did you guys know I used to work for Wingstop? I don't know if you guys ever knew that. I might have said that in the past video. Mm hmm I know the secrets of Wingstop. Yes, I do. When I moved out to Modesto, uh, that was my job there. Two down, Fluffy. I really think I'm gonna beat you, honestly. Two down, and this is the third. So how have you guys been? I've been doing good. Mmm. That was really good. Um, I rearranged the entire apartment. And I think it looks way better. I don't know why I didn't. I never done this before, and I, as long as I've lived here. But I basically moved the room into the living room, and the living room into the room. So I'm in the room right now, and it looks like a little small, like cozy living room, and it's perfect, so perfect. And then the living room is really open, which I like. Mm-hmm. Me and Mona had to go to a town over. Uh, she asked me if I wanted to go. And I said, yeah. Well, I was hesitant at first because I have so much stuff to do still. Mm -hmm. I was going to make a, I was going to go live actually today and do another video. But she's like, do you, I'm going to this town. Do you need a, Do you need anything? And I'm like, oh man. I was thinking to myself, like, the lizard doesn't have like fresh uh, mealworms. So like, okay, dang. And then I'm like, dang, wing stops over there. So I was like, you know what? Yeah, I'll go with you. I was hesitant at first though, because every time me and my mom go out to stores, like we take forever. We don't have to work tomorrow. And that's why I wanted to, um, I'm still going to be doing laundry, um, all kinds of stuff. Fluffy! I'm at, like, I'm about to be on my fourth one, and I'm not even full. I don't know if it's because I'm a fat ass or what, but I ain't full. My brother spent the night yesterday, and it was actually really good. We... I don't think he's ever spent the night here before. But we watched the new Halloween movie. And then um, we made some stuff, like crafty stuff with latex. And then, yeah, it was just fun. Mm-hmm. Really fun. 
Did you talk? This dog and this cat, Nico and Nala, are both like attacking the door. And I can see shadows going back and forth. Nico's been panting a lot, and I don't know if it's just because he's hurting or if he's hot, but it's not even hot in here, and he has plenty of water. So I had to close the door because I didn't want him in here, like you guys hearing him breathe. Man, these wings are so good. If you guys have a wing stop where you live, go try it if you haven't. You know what? It reminds me of a story. So, a long time ago, when we lived in the Tomas, a friend of mine, I don't remember who it was, introduced me to wing stop. Um, they introduced me to Wingstop and I tried it and the moment I tried it and the first one I tried was the garlic parmesan and the first thing I thought of was Mona like oh my god Mona needs to try this I'm saving her some so I got to the house and yeah you guys I let her try it and she bit into it and she's like and my mom does this all the time to everything she'll taste it eh I don't like it and then she, later on, she likes it, right? So she tried it. She went, no, no, I don't like it, I don't like it. I'm like, are you serious? I was blown away. And then um, later on that day, she's like, you know what, those wings are really good. I'm like, I told you. From then on, we were both hooked on that. So, it was really good. See, and the reason why I like these, you guys, the, the, there's not a lot of meat on it. Like, I like that. Like this one. Look at that. There's not a lot of meat. You guys might think it's skimpy, but it's not. Like, you get full off of it. You really do. I hope this doesn't mess up my stomach. Because, like I said, I've been losing weight. And, um, I haven't eaten like this. And this is kind of greasy. Mm. Mmm. Mm -mm. This camera is annoying me too. It it likes to um blur. You know what I'm saying? Mm mm mm. Mm. Looks so good in here. The blue cheese at Wingstop is bomb. And I won't get blue cheese at stores or anything or other restaurants. It's only at Wingstop I like it. And yes, they make the blue cheese fresh there. Um, when I worked there, we had to make the blue cheese. We made the ranch. We made the bourbon baked beans. We use real bourbon in the beans. Well, we did it all. Mm-hmm. Mm. One, two, three. Oh, sh I dropped a. One, two, three, four. Two, one, two, three, four, five. I'm at five, you guys. Alright you guys, so I thought doing this, um, I'm going to do some like would you rathers. I think that'd be really uh, fun to do while doing a mukbang. Because I honestly feel kind of awkward still just talking on the camera eating. And I don't know what to talk about. So I might as well try something entertaining, right? So let's see what we're going to talk about. Okay, would you rather have a dog with a cat's personality 
or a cat with a dog's personality? Ooh. Oh, shoot. I feel like I would want a cat with a dog's personality. I think it's because I love cats. And sometimes I want the kitties to like be more lovey. And you know, for most cats, they just like let you touch them when they want. And then they're like, eh, okay, leave me alone. So I think I would want a cat with a dog's personality. Would you rather eat no candy at Halloween or no turkey at Thanksgiving? Hmm. I mean, I could be technical with both answers, like both ways, but I think I would be no candy during Halloween. I'm not really big on candy, like I really don't eat sweet sweets. And I never really did when we did go trick or treating, like I would eat a couple of pieces, but I just went to dress up and just knock on people's doors. So I think I, think I would rather have no candy on Thanksgiving. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Would you rather date someone you love or date someone who loves you? Ha <laughs> ha. Um, I would pick, I would date someone who loves me. That's what I would do. I'm going to leave it at that. Would you rather look 10 years older from the neck up or the neck down? Damn, that's a, that's a good question. Um, I get a lot of compliments on my face. A lot of guys always compliment my face. So, I think how it'd be from the neck up. I don't know, that'd be weird. I'm just thinking how it would look. Ugh. I'm not sure. But I think I'm gonna go with that. Would you rather have three kids and no money or no kids and three million dollars? Dang, I really want kids, you guys all know that. So if I was to say I want kids because I would have people with me growing up and when I get old and just be loved, but then also $3 million, I can get a nice house, I don't have to stress or, or worry, I can live a, a nice life. Ooh, that's a hard one, you guys. I think I would have kids though because I just want to have a family. I want to grow old. I want to have grandkids. I just want to feel loved and I want to have a big family. So I go kids with no money. Already used to no money, so. <laughs> Would you rather continue with your life or restart it? <sighs> that is a strong, difficult question, honestly. Would I really, would I rather restart my life? Hmm. Would you rather continue your life or restart it? I think I'd probably restart it. I have nothing really going for me right now. So I really, I feel like the only people, the only thing that would be afraid of is losing all my friends and stuff, you know, like Fluffy, what if, all my, what if I restart my life and I never met her? Or whether, you know, just little things like that. Jasmine, I got all really good friends. Um, Sarah. Um, Brandon. I got a lot of good friends and I just don't know what I would do. Honestly though, I think I really would start over my life. You know, finish school. Not get in the same kind of situations I was in. Be smart about things. Yeah.
I think that's what I would do. I'm getting full. Mm. Where am I at? One, two, three, four, five, six. This is my seventh one, you guys. I can hear Nico breathing. Mm. If you guys have not had grape high C juice, bomb.com. So good. <clears throat> Oh man, I'm full. Mm. Wayne's stop is so good. Mm. Mm. It has a little crisp to it. That's why I like it so much, the crispiness of it. Mm -hmm. I'm getting full. I'm sorry this isn't a very entertaining video. I feel like it really isn't. Uh, so if you guys are bored, I apologize. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six on the floor. Seven, eight. I'm tied right now with Fluffy. I'm gonna try to do ten, because I'm really full, you guys. I feel, I don't know if it's the grease from the frying. Of the wings. Damn. I honestly thought I was going to eat this whole thing. Ugh. I used to be able to. I would order like more than 20. Not all by myself, but. You know, we had a group of people, but I would eat more than 10 for sure. Mm -mm. Well, I already beat Fluffy. I'm at nine. So I eat one more. And this last one, I'm not going to use dipping sauce. Ugh. Last one, you guys. I can only do ten. Hey, ten is better than eight. Right? A little lemon pepper. Mm. So good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I beat Fluffy. Oh, I beat Fluffy. Mm. Fl uh, Fluffy, you failed. 
he had the audacity to challenge me? Hell no. Yum, yum, yum. Yum. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then the bone that fell on the floor, ten. I'm tapping out. Oh my god. Ugh. I'm full now. I'm full. I'm full. Fluffy, I beat you. And if you ever try to challenge me again, this will be the same result. Just Martin wins it all. If you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, favorite, share with your friends and family for more content. And until next time, you guys, don't be a lemon. Be a rosebud. Peace.